Handing in your resignation is potentially very awkward. Ending any relationship is awkward. That conversation just makes people squirm. But it doesn't have to be as painful or as uncomfortable as you can imagine. Now, whether or not you've made your decision to resign, or perhaps you've even been in the situation of a forced resignation, what you want to bear in mind is the idea that you can make this experience as positive as possible, not just for yourself, but for the organization that you work for. Now let's go back for a minute. Let's just bear in mind the fact that you were given an opportunity. It began great. You came in, you interviewed, you gave your best stuff. They saw the potential in you. They decide to hire you. They give you money. You exchange services. It's a business that's growing together. And then something happened, right? Something happened. It kind of went wrong. Or maybe you found a better opportunity. Whatever the case may be, this is not your opportunity to play the blame game. This is not your opportunity to go back and do a he said, she said, then this happened and that happened. Forget about it. You have arrived at the decision, which is really the goodbye. And I want you to focus on the positive principles that you can use to make this the best experience possible. Why? Because you never know where this relationship is going to go in the future. You never know who they know. You never know by leaving your positive imprint where that can um, advance you in the future. And besides all of that, it just feels good. It reminds me of another favorite principle, the golden rule. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. The fact is it's uncomfortable for you, it's uncomfortable for them. But imagine yourself in the opposite situation where you're the boss and someone is resigning. How would you want that experience to go down? Bear that in mind. Which brings me to my third point, which is mind your manners. This golden rule is it's golden because it's just so good. When you're thinking about your experience in this organization, take the time to highlight the positives. Acknowledge the fact that you did gain something um, by way of knowledge, experience, growth opportunities, and in that space of the resignation, give it a positive spin. Explain what, you're, what, what you took away from the experience, what you hope that they took away from the experience, that you're appreciative that you were given the opportunity in the first place, and that perhaps you will even do anything in your power to make the transition even easier for whoever is taking over after you. By behaving like a class act, by using the best possible etiquette, not only are you gonna feel so much better in a clean exit, but you are also giving yourself the opportunity to take this negative situation and spin it in the most positive light. It is the perfect fuel to take you on your next journey, wherever that may be. So use this opportunity, as awkward as it may seem, to be awesome. Inspire the people that are around you that there is a different way, that there is a way to sprinkle a little bit of light even when things get a little murky.